Yo, what is up guys? Jesse LaFlair here from LaFlair Parkour bringing you a tutorial on how not to rip your hands, okay? I get a lot of questions about people getting calluses and their calluses tearing off and making these big terrible holes in their hands. It sucks and it keeps you from training and this is a pro tip a lot of the guys that have been training for years have figured out and I am passing it down to you. So, if you are getting calluses on your hands, like all these big old guys, this, 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 all those guys, what happens is the skin gets hard and most people think when they're starting out, oh that's good, your skin's getting tough, your stronger hands, but not really because what happens is those calluses become hard but the skin around it is still soft, which makes it much easier for the hard stuff to peel off of the soft stuff. So how do we avoid this? It's pretty easy. There's a few ways. One you could simply shave your hands down. Um, I've heard many different ways, but the most useful ways are these. Um, people like to use sandpaper, like this, and they'll just take some sandpaper and grind them down until they get a little softer, okay? Or, if you are like me, and this is my secret to you, I use the pet egg, okay? The pet egg actually has the sandpaper on it, but really it was designed for your feet. And there's this terrible, scary looking metal shaving device that will shave your skin off. So you will go from having big calluses, I don't know if you guys can see that, big old callus right here, to shave this. Let's see, until it goes flat. So I don't know if you guys can see how much flatter this one guy just got. But then what happens is, after you do shave your skin down, it becomes a little raw. Some people don't like this discomfort. But for me, I'd rather a little bit of a sting when I'm training on my bars or scaffolding and not tear, than tear and not be able to train bars for like a week or two because I have a giant hole in my hand. So it's up to you. But if you don't want to get this disgusting, I don't know, you guys should look how nasty this is. This is just shaving it for a second. That's the dead skin that just came off my hand. Nasty. Ew. But anyway, if you don't want to go out and buy one of these little pet eggs that I think you could buy at like, um, I don't know, Walgreens or like Bed Bath & Beyond or some, all those places that sell like the as seen on TV stuff, um, you could simply go outside and sit on a curb or if you're ever waiting for your mom to come pick you up, you could do this. And just like that, because the cement on the curb is rough, you can pretty much sand down your hands. So this is unshaved, and this one is the beginning part of getting shaved, right? They all got a lot flatter. Smooth, yeah. <laughs> I, I hope this helped, guys. That was another little bit of a advice or information that I am trying to pass down to you guys. Uh, if you have any questions, hit me up in the comment section below. And feel free to favorite, like, share, do whatever you got to do. Jesse LaFlair from LaFlair Parkour. Peace out. Look at this. Ew. Oh, It's nasty. All that dead skin. Mmm. No.